My DNA Comprehensive Health Report from Nutripath is a genetic test in which your practitioner will be able to understand some of your genetic profile, including 92 genes, 113 SNPs across categories such as digestion, energy, hormones, inflammation, DNA protection and repair. It's worth noting with the collection of DNA that privacy is a concern and so Nutripath has quite strict policy around security of this data. Um, your data will be stored on a secure encrypted server and it cannot be used to identify you and it will never be shared with an unknown third party without your consent. Looking at your kit, you will find some collection instructions. Even though we're talking through this in the video, please take a moment and read through so that you completely understand all of the things that you need to do to prepare yourself and to actually perform this test. There are two swabs, two little collection vials with orange lids, a plastic biohazard bag in which your samples will go once you've collected, a requisition form, an Australia Post Express Post bag, and a checklist that you will be able to use once you've done your collection. Collection days for this test are Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday. It must be done early in the week. Just be mindful of any public holidays. Preparation looks like fasting overnight, so eight to 10 hours of fasting. And for 45 minutes before your collection, do not drink any water. Also before collection, don't eat anything, don't drink, don't brush your teeth or floss your teeth, avoid any chewing gum, don't have any caffeine products and don't use tobacco. To do the collection, open one of your swabs. So both of so set out your swabs and your vials onto, um, onto a flat surface that's nice and clean. Open one of the swab packets and you basically sort of swipe and scrape the inside of just one side of your mouth, so one cheek only with that swab. Um, take about 45 seconds, move it all around, twist the swab so that it's um, getting lots of exposure and contact there. And then once you have done that for 45 seconds, open one of the little vials with the yellow, uh, sorry, the orange lid. You'll put the tip into that and you'll see on that long tip, um, there is a little black line, a delineation there, and that's what you snap off. And so the end, the tip of that swab actually just stays in the vial in that solution. Pop the lid back on it and then do exactly the same, but for the other side of your mouth with that second swab. Also, once you've done it, just put those little um, vials with the orange lids into that plastic biohazard bag. Make sure your paperwork is all filled out. Please make sure all of your personal details are on that. Makes it much easier for the lab to know who you are. You'll see on the outside of the biohazard bag, there's a little sleeve. Just slide the requisition form in there. Go over the checklist and make sure that you've completed everything you need to complete. And post in the Australia Post shop closest to you on the day of collection. We're looking at about four to six weeks for a turnaround for this test, hopefully quicker. And as soon as it's back, your healthcare team will let you know.